Welcome to day 24. Today's question was an elderly male presenting with lower urinary tract symptoms. His histopathological picture and an MRI image were given to you. The correct answer is BPH. It is the most common benign prostatic disease in males older than 50 years. It has nodular hypoplasia in the prostate ke stromal or epithelial cells ka, and it is not a pre-malignant lesion. Patients present with lower urinary tract symptoms like urinary frequency, nocturia, difficulty in starting and stopping the stream of urine. Urinary stasis ho jata hai and it is treated by alpha blockers. Grossly, the prostate is enlarged, it weighs between 60 to 100 grams and remember nodular hyperplasia begins in the transition zone. Microscopically, there are nodules composed of proliferating glands and fibromuscular stroma. The glands are lined by two layers, basal cuboidal and above it columnar cells. Remember about PSA, it is the most important test used in the diagnosis and management of prostate cancer. But remember, PSA organ specific hai, cancer specific nahi hai. Isle wo BPH mein bhi bar jata hai, prostatitis mein bhi bar jata hai, prostate instrumentation mein bhi bar sakta hai. Isle ek 4 nanogram ki hum cut off range rakte hai. Kabhi bhi PSA ki level ko aap age ke saath interpret ki chiye. 4.5 nanogram humko elevated lag sakta hai 40 year male ke liye lekin ek 60 year male ke liye wo normal ho sakta hai so we now rely, rely on psa density which is the ratio between psa value and the volume of prostate gland and more specifically on the psa velocity which is the rate of change of psa which distinguishes between men with and without prostate cancer and the cutoff for this PSA velocity is taken at 0.75 nanogram per ml per year. So, at least 3 PSA measurements must be performed over a period of 1.5 to 2 years. Or treatment ke baad, post treatment PSA is of importance in monitoring the progress or recurrence. Now, quick revision on prostate cancer IHC is a macker. Gleason system is used to grade prostate cancer. The hematogenous dissemination occurs to bone that is their osteoblastic secondary and there are urinary PCA3 with screening of urine for Tempress to ERG fusion DNA. Thank you so much.